Now this is a sight we're all familiar with. A policeman stood by the roadside like that, pointing a gun at you or a radar or a laser or whatever it's called, I'm not so sure. And Chris and uh, his colleague Gary here have got, what is it this? Is this a, a laser it says on there? Yep, Pro Laser speed detection device. Um, so the old handheld radars used to have a really wide beam. Yeah. And you get interference from big wagons and slow moving vehicles, etc. And a road like this, we've got this dual carriageway effect. 40 limit, invariably your, your vehicles that are speeding would be in the offside lane. Mm -hmm. but the old radar would struggle to pick them up. Right. And it was too close to actually jump out and try and stop them by the time you pick them up. The laser, however, for instance, on this view here, we've got probably about 1,500 feet view. The beam will have spread no more than three inches. Well, right. Is that accurate? That accurate. You can actually wow. pick up cyclists and pedestrians can you? with this, yeah. Speeding pedestrians? Oh, yes. Well, <laughs> probably not speeding, but yeah, you can pick pedestrians right. up. Okay, so we're in what, 40 mile an hour limit here? Yeah. So do you have a, there must be a guideline somewhere that tells you. The guidelines at what are, point yeah. You're going to we book somebody we could start prosecuting or issuing tickets at about 47 miles per hour. Right. Okay. But because we are in road traffic department, we've got a certain amount of discretion as right. to how fast a vehicle will be before we would actually deal with it by way of process. So you'd look at a day like this, well, it's nice and fine, visibility is good, the road surface is dry, mm -hmm. the traffic flow is not too heavy. Yeah. So we could say, well, okay, you know, there's not too much danger at this moment in time. We could perhaps raise the stakes a little bit and maybe not start issuing tickets for maybe 50 miles an hour, right. something like that. Obviously, if we start getting the weather coming in, we get a wet, wet road surface, we get rush hour traffic, then we'll just start looking at it. comes down, obviously, that, that speed, that, yeah. That, yeah, that yeah. Would, uh, leeway down so, a little so, bit. So what does that do? I mean, in a nutshell, can you tell me in a nutshell how it works? What does it do? Send a beam and measure yeah, how it just it shoots out. Yeah, uh, uh, a non-aggressive laser beam, if you like, not right. one that would be you know, you'd use for cutting. Right. OK, that would be a bit dodgy. That would be, would be a bit dodgy. Sends it out, it bounces off the car, comes back, the device measures the the speed it comes back and it shows up and if you look around yes. here right. it actually shows you the speed right. and it shows a plus or minus so there's no arguments to say well it was the vehicle going the other way oh, it's going right. the other way it would yeah. say minus right so get the plus the speed and then this is the distance in feet on this side here right so if, you, if that, that said minus if it was going away that means you can do do people for speeding if you like going in either direction yeah, it would be just yeah. as accurate really yeah. and if yeah. gary fires down there get lock on a vehicle away down to show you how far down that so is actually it'll tell you how far away the vehicle is and how fast it's going, and yeah. it's exactly right. So what we're trying to do wow. is, what happens is we see a vehicle travelling towards us and we form an opinion of how fast that vehicle's going. So we're actually stopping a vehicle on our opinion of that vehicle's speed. Right. And because we're in road traffic, we're allowed to give evidence of expert opinion because we're considered experts when it comes to speed, being traffic officers. Of course, yeah. So we see the vehicle and say, yeah, I think that vehicle's doing about 50 miles an hour. We then check it with the speed gun. So the speed gun is actually our corroboration for the offence. <coughs> right. So we lock on, let it run for a couple of seconds just to make sure the speed is either increasing, decreasing or steady. Then we lock it on for the speed recorder. So, what, I mean, what do you do? You press a button on that and it sort of goes, got you, does it, or something like yeah, that? Yeah, if you I press mean... the trigger and it records whatever speed that vehicle's doing. So right. as long as you've got the trigger depressed, it keeps showing the speed, whether it's decreasing or increasing, right. and you'll see the distance The distance is changing as the vehicle's as it comes towards us. When you're satisfied you've got the, the speed you want, release the trigger and it locks the reading out on the heads-up display there. How do you know which car it is, though? I mean, that, no, that's... Well, there's that's a sighting reticle in the heads-up display there. There's a little red sighting reticle. Right. You get that square on your vehicle and it's not checking anything because the beam is so small, does it, it can't be checking anything else. Does it, yeah, but does it take a picture of the vehicle or something? Or no. Do you have to go and chase it? Not this one. You can link it in. Lays into a photographing what device. What I mean is, if, if, if uh, this van coming up the road now, if he's doing 60 mile an hour now, you're going to say, right, click 60 mile an hour, bang, yeah. I love you for that. How does he get his ticket? I mean, do you, have to, do you, do you have to write no, his no, number down? No, we stop him now. You have to go and stop him yeah. now. Oh, Which right. the beauty of this year, because it goes so far down the road, we can have the vehicle checked and locked on at maybe 600, 700 feet away. Which gives us plenty of time to walk out and stop the vehicle safely to pull them in. So what you're saying is by the time you've seen that laser gun, if you've been speeding, it's probably too late. Yeah. <laughs> oh dear. Right, Chris, can, can I have a go at this? If you can convince Gary to get out of it, yeah. Gary, come on, go on, Gary. Move over. Move over, he's only a sergeant. <laughs> it's all right. Right, what do we do here, Chris? Right, if you look in the heads up display just here. It's like a shooting game yeah. and a computer. Little rectangle. I can see it. Okay. Aim the gun way down the road. It's no good doing it close to. Right. So look beyond these vehicles coming towards you. Can see the green building down there. Yeah. That's where the traffic signals are. I can are. see them, right? Okay. Right, so let these vehicles clear out of the way. Yeah. And then aim down there. It's flashing. This is that right? That's, That's right. It's just yeah. locked on from the previous check. 
Okay. okay. Now, it's just coming towards you now, so you press the trigger. Press the trigger now. Yeah, just keep it, on, keep it locked down. Keep it locked down. I've locked it, I've locked it. Keep your trigger on. I've got the trigger on. All right, now keep it. it aim. You've got to aim it at a vehicle, though. I'm so it. keep I'm the rectangle on the vehicle. That truck down there. All right, and you'll see the speed changing, you'll see the distance changing. Yeah, he's doing 24 mile an hour, 25 yeah. mile an hour. And we just pulled out that side. 30, road. He's speeding up, watch him. He's going for it. All right, there, nice to tell you. You let go of the trigger, let go. and it locks on. Locks on. Plus 34, 285 feet. So to get rid of that, just click yeah. the trigger once. Yeah. That clears it off, and you can start again. Now, we've got a nice clear field now. It's a piece of cake, this. Easy, isn't it? Yep. <laughs> Just with this, it's so accurate. Right, OK. So you wait for the next batch of cars coming through the lights. Come on, come on then. You're ready for it, yeah? Like there they it. come Here now. Look, so if you get the reticle on that. So if we get him on there. Depress the trigger. I keep it depressed. And I see it's recording at nearly 1,400 feet. Yeah. Speed's 33. You're building up very, very slowly. They're going steady by and they can see us all the way down here with these they yellow shirts. They can't miss us, can they, really, with this lot on? They do, do. We've had them down here at 75 miles an hour, believe it or not. 38. Stood in this exactly same place. 38, 34, he's slowing down. 32, he's seen us. <laughs> he's slowing down. <laughs> right, we'll let him go, that one. Hang on, okay. here's one. Here's another one coming, look. Right, I'm going to get one of these. Yeah, offside lane now, he's going I'm fairly gonna, quickly. I'm look, gonna... he's building speed up. Coming towards you, get the offside lane. Yeah, 43. Him. 43, great, got him. Right, done it. Get him booked. <laughs> <laughs> we'll remember this next time you're stopped, eh? 43 to 40.